previous sessions you notice that there is some error on the screen what's called the one or more problems detected in Drupal installation so we need to find out what it is so click on status report it will tell you where what are the different errors it need to be out of date we need to update it the one which is in red is more important it says the trusted host pattern is not configured in settings PHP file right we can right click on that to find out more about it click on a new tab we go over there you should be reading this uh, information and to see exactly what need to be done at times uh, we can get different errors so you should understand what are the errors about anyway for this tutorial I'm just making it short to say that in the settings PHP file we need to add this pattern on our server let's go to our code that is on open application folder you can find that open application folder and it is in apps Drupal HD docs sites default and settings we need to update the code over here in one of our previous session we created a shortcut Drupal Vietnami Drupal and this is the site and default and settings so we need to update this file that's what error message says according to the error message we need to update this file this code so we are opening it in um, I'm using notepad and you search for find trusted host patterns you find that you'll find that in three different places one two three okay this is the start of the code this is the end of the code so we copy this control C to copy and put it over here see it's not working the reason is not it's not working because this is write only file so in notepad you go here and clear read only flag then you should be able to add the code these are the comment line comment that out remove the comment if you remove the star the code become enabled remove the star it's a comment line remove that then come to this side and say you write localhost localhost that's what uh, we are using so localhost that is that's our uh, the site name for us let's see if it works localhost you delete this up to here save it after saving it you must put it read only status put it back go back to your site and reload it now that error message is now gone that's how you fix it you can get uh, notepad from you just type in uh, in Google notepad plus plus you can get that it's one of the free and the easy code edit editor I use and it's very yeah, helpful always make sure that uh, this is uh, set back to read only you close it go back to the site it's all working configuration no errors there reports status report everything is fine except that it says um, I need to update it later we can do that later in this tutorial we learned about how to fix the errors going to the Drupal website and read the information and follow the instructions in there that's how you fix it thank you